to Flux. I never went to Flux. Which I think is maybe the strip club we ended up at last time. Because I don't remember getting ambushed. It's very, very possible. I was an absolute fucking mess. But if I was able to beat that fight while I had, like, an industrial quantities of rum flowing through my fucking tubes, then, oh my god, I deserve a medal. I deserve to finally ascend to the godhood that everyone knows I'm worth. Uh, where am I going? That's the alleyway. This is the fucking precision. Where's Flux? How do I keep walking past you? Garrus, we haven't seen Garrus yet. I really want to. I want to scream again. I, I, I've rewatched the VOD and <laughs> I genuinely like, I, I am fangirling over this man aggressively and I will continue to do so. I, I'll fangirl over Rex when we finally discover that lovely boy. Did we go this way? I'm also convinced there's a fucking sprint. So they wouldn't remaster Mass Effect 1 without putting in a fucking sprint, right? What is this music? It's like the- <laughs> You guys know Spongebob? You know the Jellyfish Jam episode? I'm pretty sure that is this. Use or sprint. Go, Shepard! Oh my god! We've been able to do this the whole fucking time and I just- No, we never went this way. This is the completely different strip club. Why are there so many? Oh, wow. Well, you're a complete piece. I don't necessarily consider you human with hair like that. What the fuck? You're mostly geode. I don't like him. That's the scariest thing we've seen since we fucking got here. Rita and all of my friends died on Eden Prime. We got Rita, we got Doran, we got that lady, and no one else interesting. I'll see if I can talk some sense here for next time. Oh, I remember this though. Let's hang out with Doran first. Welcome to Flux. I sent for Garrus and only Garrus. That what is perfectly understandable. You? Not Rex. You gotta love Rex. I mean, I, I don't recommend fucking Rex or potentially simping for him because it might lead to that. But Jesus, the ultimate form of man, the manliest of all the men. Like I just quite like to pitch camp in his mouth and just stay there for the rest of the game because nowhere could possibly be safer. So let's go up Flux. Is this a casino? Oh, I spent forever here things, in the first game because yes. I was really good at the gambling. We've got some Quasar stations, uh, if you're interested. Might not be able to reach the joysticks from Rex's mouth, but hey, at least you get all the money because he only accepts money when he kills people. So if you're willing to simp, have a list of victims in mind. They're about to get drowned in his war turtle bathwater. And he only bathes in his enemy's remains, so we better get that blood drive running. We might be able to make a, uh, might be able to save some real lives with this. As long as we have a steady supply of... Ended ones? Quasar? In, in the UK, Quasar is laser tag, but I, I assume that's just the gambling? I, I don't really want to bully some children in the laser tag. The owner? I am like owner, a trained cook, alliance veteran. I've even been known to dance a little when the mood strikes. But then again, three. Oh, he's so We've cute. We've got some quasar stations, uh, if you're interested. This man gets up on the pole. Also, he says that after every single fucking line. He really wants me to throw away all my money. Enjoy your time here at Flux. But the only way I'm willing to throw away all my fucking money, dude, is if you jump up on the stripper pole. Is this not a strip club? No, people just do just hang out over here. Okay, so dancing used to break the game in every Mass Effect game. So, did they, did they just remove it? Can you not dance anymore because they couldn't fix the bug? So you used to dance in Mass Effect 1, and it were at least in my modded version, maybe the, maybe the dancing was cut content that the mod put back in, who knows? But you used to come out of the dance and you'd be like levitating. You would be the second coming himself and you wouldn't be able to leave the dance floor. Maybe I'm thinking Mass Effect 2, maybe it was never possible in 1, but I'm pretty damn sure it was. Now talk to me, Rita. I will be quick saving at every possible opportunity, by the way, because the Citadel used to be really buggy. So one, I'm worried about crashes. Uh, I assume they've fixed the bugs in the remaster, but if they haven't, then I'm very, very scared. My cock is already withering away. It's, it's, it's like turtle heading itself back inside of my body just to make sure it doesn't need to witness the travesty of me losing like three hours progress. Sorry, I'm kind of busy. Only Garrus. So uh, what can I do for you? What's the problem? What were you discussing with the Volus? The Volus? Oh, He's the oh, we just had a perfectly just casual conversation with him, and now it's just the Volus. She left too. 
sorry. I don't want to bore you. If you problems. manage to bore me in Mass Effect, you're some kind of dark, hexing, miracle witch say. woman. Girl oh, of the okay. Glades, My bitch sister of the fire. Go and I'm the down. Down. Is, she's but if you succeed, I'm drowning or burning no, you, depending on uh, what's down. less resource intensive. Out what she's doing, they'll kill her. That's not good. I'm Being glad we came here first, because we need to go to Korra's Den anyway, so... That's what I've been telling her. Mm, I don't know. Sometimes I think she stays there just to spite me. Have you talked to C-Sec? Because I, uh... I got a... I got a future best friend in C-Sec who might be out a somewhat, uh... You know who her contact is? the squid, to no. so to speak. You it's know, all very I know. Secret. It's Last potentially in his skill set. For Jenna's safety. What the fuck are you talking- Cora's dead. The amount- Oh yeah, to be fair, I've seen many, like, Alliance officers and CSEC officers just sit there and, and, and drink in all the sights anyway. So I imagine that's got something to do with it. They don't want to take away that titty license. Maybe I can help her understand just how dangerous Cora's Dan is. Would you? That'd be great. <laughs> yeah, I'll go just punch your sister in the you. face so she loses well, her I job. Back to work before I get in trouble. What a good Samaritan I am. Thanks. Uh, can I now talk to the Volus about it? No, I'm doing it. Hello again. Can I help you? Oh, I can. Reader and Jenna. What can Let's you get tell me in about trouble. the sisters working for you? Well. Jenna left to work at Cora's den. Holy shit, a Volus that isn't a nightmare. It's so almost like I shouldn't judge their entire race trouble. against the three criminals and sleazy politician Napoleon mind. complex this forbidden balloons one. that we've met so far, huh? If she I wouldn't mind working back, on my I'd dribble game with you. Uh, not Customers necessarily meaning her. bouncing around in basketball. Although there would be a lot of bouncing. And you are so perfectly round. A grade. If I'm trying to put it on a round to make it make sense. Does make sense. I Fuck it. Move on. Flooding. One oh one. Here at with Uncle Strike. You just got a date. Uh, PSA everyone. Uh, I'm waiting for someone else. Quasar available. We're finally gonna go do it. Uh, like and subscribe. <laughs> hey. <laughs> so cute. Low stakes, high stakes. I feel like it's gambling that you can just automatically win at, though. I think you can be good at it. Suspicious gambling machine? Somebody rigged this machine to fund credits through the system. Somebody rigged your vocal cords to be some kind of horrible sand dune blasted mix between all the pharaoh's Jew plagues all on one guy's throat. How did 2,000 locust taste, you chain-smoking, frog-spawn, gargling, spiky brain tumor farm? Can you tell I hate Kaiden? Can you tell I love gambling? Let's have let's have a lot more of the latter and a lot less of that bitch. This is easy. I don't understand how people lose at blackjack. I'd one to eight. I'd one to eight. We're gonna be here for years. This is becoming a gambling stream now. TOS, TOS, TOS. Twelve, one to eight. Just give me eight, give me eight, give me eight. You fuckers. Four to seven? I just realized that four to seven is, is the smarter option here. Pay out 200, okay, pay out. Oh, okay, so I only got the money I put back in. That was dumb. Five, give me four to seven. Mm, give me one to eight, if we can hit eight, this is big monies. Ah, oh, four to seven, that's gonna take us really high. We're gonna get a payout no matter what. You absolute bitch, I hate you. Well, we can get our money back. It's really hard to lose money, it's just also quite hard to gain. I won't be sitting here for too long. I also don't really remember money being all that important in Mass Effect anyway, so... Uh, getting any of these wouldn't be great. I think we need a low number just to figure out where the hell we are. Thank you, the lowest of all low numbers. Much appreciated. One, just give me an eight, give me an eight, give me an eight. Close. I can, get, I can get my 200 credits back. If we lose 200, I don't particularly care. I can just beat people up for money anyway. Ow! Fuck, it got to literally 21 as well. No, I'm not good at this. We're leaving. I don't remember how to play. I mean, it's Blackjack. Everyone knows how to play. Why is it called Quasar? Oh, fucking dead. Gone against all my human values. There was an English word for that, you fuckers. Let's get the hell out of here. Just, I'm not black, and my name's not Jack, so I get a distinct disadvantage, because this ain't my home turf. If it was called... Fuck... Jockey... 
I've been known to ride a horse in Minecraft. Uh, once, maybe, at best, but there was never any Skelebona on the, uh, on the fucking sidelines, willing to pay up, willing to cough it out, willing to, uh, baby bird some bone meal, but maybe... Maybe it's a misleading, misleading phrase. I don't think that came out of his mouth. There's no connective tubing. A lot of people got some bullets aimed directly at my mouth and I'm, uh, I'm ready. Who am I to say no? What an offer. What a lovely, nutritious meal. Serious fun with a laser gun. <laughs> yeah, and they took Quasar from us. That meant something to us, uh, UK public probably a bit. I think they shot down our one as well, Jamie. Close to us. How could that? I mean, I haven't been there in about 10 years, but still. Why is that all you ever have to say about that anything? Professional opinion, sir. <laughs> He's right, Chief. This is indeed a big place. Why are you calling her Chief? Is it. Is she. Is she Chief Williams? Don't you outrank me, or is this just. Have you suddenly started talking like Robin Williams? Time to therapize, Sonny Jim, or the this female a equivalent, uh, Daughtery Jane. There must be millions here. It can't be Did they? Yeah, I think so, dude. Coming and going. This makes Jump Zero look like a portage on, and it's the largest deep space station the Alliance has. Jump Zero is big, but this is a whole nother scale. Look at the ward arms. How do they keep all that mass from flying apart? Melting pot is inadequate. Why, <laughs> why do we talk like this? I always expect the middle option to be sort of a- but when it's between your crew? Like sarcastic mediation, being fair to both sides, not really siding with one just to bring everyone together like Oh! 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 oh captain, you're so silly! And everyone forgets how mad they are, right? But this one is telling the very codex itself that its vocabulary is inferior and that it needs to expand its mind. And that if it wants to melt pot, buy a space bomb. Or a very hot Venus flytrap. One attractive enough to actually catch it Venus. We're, it, we're high up going. enough. It has to be hard keeping all these cultures working together. It's been open Maybe 26 years, I'm like genuinely humans. sad about that. Oh dude. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to upset you. Everyone comes to my stream to wallow in their own pain, so. And sometimes my pain. Let my pain drown out your pain, and then everyone's fine. Ah. Oh, shut the fuck up, Ash. That's enough, you tip what's not to like. Why not? We've got oceans, beautiful women, this emotion called love. According to so the old did bit, they. they have everything they want. If you expect to get me in a tinfoil miniskirt and thigh high boots, I want dinner first. The hell has got. Look how sad Shepard looked about enough, that. Chief. Where did that even come from? You've known me for like three minutes. I've shown no interest because I exclusively fuck aliens. You're not blue enough for me, Ashley. Um. It's alright. <laughs> Forget it. That would be unprofessional. It's alright. At ease, Lieutenant. Can't see her in a skirt anyway. This is a really Damn, strange conversation. Ready to move out, sir. Kaiden wants to move out because he doesn't want to hear Mama and Papa plonking. It's okay, are. man. We only explore Flange Palace when you're at school. Good luck getting that out of your head for your uh, for your SATs, buddy. And uh, by the way, yeah, I wear this Krogan armor. To be fair, I can fit my entire body into one of the leg holes, so it just adds to the layers of taboo. You know, it's like strip teasing for a mole colony. You know, and it, obviously it does, doesn't even come close to the main taboo of the fact that they are biologically incapable. Of the sick acts that we perform in the air vents of your boy, Norman D. Norman. Um, don't know what the D stands for, probably one of the events that's about to occur. Uh, the drugging, uh, and I don't mean the Krogans are biologically inept and capable, and because uh, I don't think this piece of lore has come up, but let's just say it's not because of the, uh, Twisty, turny, scaleetrix, pretzel, pretzels, uh, hey, I know you. food You're prep, cock right? jenga that we're the involved in. Oh no 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 no! Yeah, I'm sure you you'll there. find that they you are survived. more like than malleable. I'm sorry, they I require optimum like sponge flow, after all. Uh, my name's Isn't Lad, too difficult, officer, honestly, when it looks like you can do a keg stand on that cock. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can help you with? You're like Jabba the Hutt, except you chug four fucking protein shakes an hour. What happened to you? Who let the slug get buff? 
Uh, God, okay, so he's a fan. Little bit less simpy than Comrade. Haven't had to fill out a fucking autograph yet, so let's just ask about CSEC. Why'd you join Citadel Security? At least the humans can know. get in here. like the right That's thing cool. to do, you know? Maybe it's in my blood. My grandfather was a cop back on Earth. It's kind of what CSEC is. Police for the Citadel. I'm still pretty new at it, but I like it so far. Way more interesting than staying back on Earth. You get to meet all kinds of cool aliens. Like those hands. Oh, sug, Wild. slug, blood. Plus, CSEC gets a lot of respect here. We uphold the law. People, even aliens, appreciate that. I guess that. it's somehow the only way that, uh... Humans are really gonna get any permanent respect on the Citadel, huh? Alright, good for you, dude. Good for you. Buff slug- Genuinely, like, slugs are my biggest nightmare anyway. You add muscles into that? If there's a slug that can kick the shit out of me? I, I, I don't know, because I, I think the thing that terrifies me about slugs the most is the goo. And just, there is no worse feeling in the world than accidentally stepping on a slug in the night and just feeling it... Ugh. No, I can't, I can't- I can't find the words to describe it because, for one, there is no word in the human- in, in the human language I nearly went with, in the English language, that describes quite how disgusting it feels. But also, just- I- I don't want to weird myself out right now. Buff Slug is at least a funny image, and I can just look at him. If all slugs looked like this guy, I'd be fine. I'd happily step on him in the pitch black night. Uh, <laughs> the Citadel. And honestly, that seems to be what he wants me to do. How do you like what all my fans want me to do? This place is amazing. I've been here almost a year, and I still haven't seen a tenth of it. The Presidium's just so beautiful. Good place to go and relax. But I really like it here down in the wards. There's always something going on somewhere. Like that new club they just opened a few months ago, Flux. Wicked scene in there, Commander. You should check it out when you have some time. Yeah, there's like a whole 20 people in there. It's really... It's re it's really, uh, poppin', funk, funky fresh, as, as, as the youth proclaim. Okay, um, th did I ask about the Citadel? Yes, I did. Let's ask about Spectres. What do you know about the Spectres? Just the stuff they show in the vids. <laughs> got extra angry. They always make them out to be base? super agents on secret missions to save the galaxy. I know it's not really like that, though. Some of the other CSEC guys don't like them too much. Figure they shouldn't be able to operate outside the law. But if they were so bad, the Council wouldn't use them, right? Step on me, Ed? I don't have, like, I don't have shoes on, dude. I've, I've, I've never, like, felt... I don't think my feet have ever touched human flesh. Or, like, the soles of my feet. I don't know what that so feels like. I, I'm sounding more and more like a murderer as deep as I go. <laughs> I want to know what lifeless human flesh feels like on my feet. No, um... <laughs> I don't know. I don't think that's a pleasant experience for anyone, Scott. I'll, I'll, I'll pass on that one. Maybe if I get myself some stilettos. Erotic roleplay, erotic roleplay, erotic roleplay, erotic roleplay, erotic roleplay. I'll roleplay as myself, except I have some stilettos. Does that work for you? It's working for me. Harkin. Do you know a CSEC officer named Harkin? I shouldn't really say too much. He's been on the force a lot longer than me. But I've heard things, you know? Drinking on the job. I'm confusing bribes, Harkin kind of and uh, Admiral Rumors Hackett mostly, all the time. But they suspended him, so some of it must be true. Harkin's the Turian, right? That we upset the prostitute for by accident. I have to go. Right. You're probably real busy. Well, see you around, Commander. Absolutely, my love. Absolutely. Didn't even give him a fucking autograph. I mean, he didn't ask for one, but I feel like it, it was implied, right? We should probably just hand autographs to everyone we fucking meet, and I'm sure that won't get obnoxious in like two seconds at all. In light of the recent attack on News! Eden Prime, many I recognize that voice. Who are you? Are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization. That's a guy. We know this guy. Was an isolated case. If any of you know a single guy, please reach out. Shortly. Any guys Many in chat now, I call upon thee! Have some He's probably just the newsreader in every game in the protected. world. I like to listen to the elevator conversations, by the way. Uh, elevator rides and the conversations in them used to be a way to mask loading times back in the day, but obviously now on a, you know, in the remaster, loading times don't particularly exist. So, uh, but we'll probably still be listening to every last one of them, because they, they always added shit. I thought it was a really good way to mask loading times. In fact, probably the best way to mask loading times I've ever seen in any game ever. Good job, Mass Effect. I'm so in love with you. Where's Garrus? Are all these imposters wearing his fucking face? Or just, you know, the same racism. But it's the same thing here. It makes me equally angry. Let's go to the wreck office. The office of wrecking. 
Got some hardcore wrecking to do, and you're gonna help me, officer. One sec, looking you up. <laughs> His weird jiggly fingers! Who gave him tip jiggle physics? Commander Shepard, here with the Alliance military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? Sure is, you know me what, because he's C-Sec. Obviously he's gonna know- Shepard isn't that stupid. He's not that paranoid about any everything, except, you know what? Maybe he should be, because he is so psychologically damaged. I got a roleplay! I got a roleplay as a sad little baby boy! You know me? How do you know who I am? I'm the C-Sec Requisitions Officer. I need to make sure- I love the music in this game so much. So. Will you be purchasing anything today, Commander Shepard? I need supplies, Show me what please, you've got. Excellent. I hope you find what you're looking for. You ever try to, like, add man onto the end of something? It's like, sound, like, a bit cool, and then you just realize that policeman is kind of just what you call them anyway. Good, good job, me. Biotic app. Uh, I feel like that's not a permanent upgrade. That's something I could put on, like, I think you can add amps to biotic uh, warriors, so we won't be worrying about that right now. I do have a lot of things that I could sell. I have no humans that will ever be able to wear heavy armor, I think. Unless maybe once you upgrade Ash, she can. Because, you know, she's... I think she's soldier class. Sell all junk as well. I had no junk. Wow. Okay. I'm efficient. I don't know what counts as junk. I don't know what you can pick up in this game that is junk. But whatever, we'll sell you. A little extra money. Sniper rifle, the hammer. I think this is all just bad. But we don't have an inventory limit, from what I can tell, but... Oh, we are about to pick up some new dudes! I don't want to sell things that I might be able to use down the line, but if there does end up being some kind of arbitrary inventory limit, I don't see why there would be. We have an entire fucking spacecraft to store it on. But... Okay, let's go ahead and sell you. Sell you, you're a piece of shit. You're shit, you're shit, you're shit, you're shit. You're shit, you're also shit, you're shit. Your shit, your shit, your shit. And then we'll keep the upgrades. Just in case I ever find a, uh, find a use for those. They're only level 1, so I'll probably just ignore them. They won't have nearly as much of an effect as they should. Plus, the weapons that I'll put them on will quickly replace in fucking seconds anyway. And by that time, we'll have some, like, level 4 upgrades or whatever. So, no real need to do that. What does this lead me? It leads me to the lower wards. The docking bay is something totally separate. That takes me to the Presidium. Let's go to their offices first. I really thought that this is where we see Garrus. My beautiful man. I'm a terrible stalker. Uh, but I do remember this place. Man, going back to... Like, I don't know why I recognize these places so well. Because there's probably, like, one interaction you'll ever have in this fucking place. But it's burned into my fucking... Hippocampus, is that is that a okay. part of the brain? I think so. I think I did a smart and then immediately ruined it by questioning everything I've ever lived for. Well, no, uh, not exactly. Oh, he's but so he small! With me. I think he's going to kill me. He's got that adorable generic nerd voice. I I can't really get into the details, but Shorbin will kill me if I leave here unprotected. I can't help you. Not unless you give me something more to go on. I... I can't. I'm sorry. You really can't hand out, like, a single one and of your I've space condoms, you selfish but bitch. I... But nothing. Don't bother me unless you're willing to give me detail. Okay. Alright, we're gonna hang out with Jaleed, because this man's absolutely useless, and what's he gonna do with those pathetic little toothpick arms anyway? How did you become a cop? What fucking training did you have to put? Like, a baby Turian? A literal newborn Turian could kick your ass. Hey Jaleed himself oh, could probably kick your ass. You're not C-Sec, are you? Did you want something? What were you trying to explain to the officer before? I'm way thicker than him. My I got you, buddy. My trying to kill me. And I thought we were friends. Kill you? How do you know he wants you dead? He's changed. He won't talk to me at work anymore, and... He started following me. Yesterday, he followed me all the way home, just waiting for a chance. You know what? I can't blame him. I don't care what anyone thinks. He wants me gone. I know it. You shouldn't wear an outfit quite so slutty. Who could ever resist? If only his little stubby nubbies could reach. How about I just biotic bowl him at you? I was about to say Wii Sports in real life, but that is sports. The Wii only starts spurting if you 
If you're bad at them, then the crowd Is something will I can do? bully you. Talk to your friend, baby. E -E -E. Strike one! Would you? Your parents Rental hate you! Someone to talk to. That's the game! Tell Cry, him to leave nerd! Me alone. Well, that was a bit easy. He thinks he can just push me around, but you'll show him, won't you? I'll talk to him. Yes, I'll help you. Can't help you. I don't know which is the nice boy option, so I guess we'll just go for our talk to him. Just tell me where he is and I'll go find him. Oh, right. Well, he wanted to meet with me down in the wards near the markets. He said he just wanted to talk, but I know better. I can't believe they didn't give him a list. His name's Shorban. He's oh, a hold on. We spoke you to him. You shouldn't have any trouble. He's just a scientist. Or was that Morlan? Morvan? That's the guy who asked us to scan the Keepers. Oh, shit. The Keepers? Well... Even more reason to go after him. That's against regulations. Can someone just roundhouse kick fucking Kaiden in the face? Can you shut the fuck up? I'm not even sure I trust this adorable little meatball man. And and he's giving away all our little secrets. That I'm running around scanning all the keepers. We were told it was highly against regulations. But okay, whatever. Bastard. <laughs> Who am I calling a bastard? I'm not sure if that's just suddenly 180 on this adorable little man, or if we're going for Chorban, so, good point. I better look into this right away. Find out what he's up to. Anything's possible with Chorban these days. I swear well, the same guy luck. was calling him Chorban, like, five seconds ago, and now it's suddenly like, Chorban. <laughs> sounds so much less cool. Chorban sounds like the verb for committing the act of Chorb. Or a strawberry right after it's got down off the fucking lofty crucifixion of the uncapitalized T. And, uh, thrown off the shackles of a berry suffix for life. Progressive. Don't be held down by your labels. It labels are a, are a cause. Alright, Shorbos. Let's get a fucking Shorbin. Let's Shorb all over Shorbin, shall we? See just how much his own personal shorbs can take until he bans us from his shorbs. It's us with a real nasty shore ban. Man, don't you think it's a chore to ban us, chore ban? Come on, why don't we invite you down the shore and I can introduce you to my friend Ben. Recently got out of the sin bin. Can I put bin in there? I s oh, there's not enough syllables in the world. Come on, Shorban, why don't I bake you a nice shoe bun? Uh, to really put us past this, you know? That way I don't have to beat you down with the lesser known, forgotten, uh, unsung hero of medieval weapons known as the, uh, the, the Beck. Beck de Chauvin. Oh, we're pushing it now. All right, let's go jam a digital drinking straw up every single ice of every single fucking bloated mantis on this cyber station. And suck out $30 a pop, even though we were just like, oh, no more that bastard, how dare he? 30 creds, 30 creds, my man. No matter if we need to store it in dirty sheds until, uh, until the time of unfurling comes. Forget praying mantis. Start praying for mantis us. I'm sure it's borderline legal and moderation, you know, sometimes, sometimes you just slip and fall. And your lungs expand at the exact same fucking time. It, it's it's unavoidable, really. I've got an irritable, exci excitable, honestly, diaphragm. I just can't keep it on its leash uh, because I think I'd choke to death. So wait, wait, wait. Is Harkin not the same dude who's um shat on the prostitute? And by shat on, like not not he, he ain't scared. A Solarian excavation team has run into an unexpected shit. problem after um, unearthing a protest. I feel so bad for scat man. Our protesters have blocked like, the dig He's such an adorable fucking man. The and then after his death, the all these should not be disturbed. <laughs> freaks just crawled up from the depths of hell and started on getting shat on and shitting on others. Solution. And they called it scat. And now scat man's scat man John's name is forever just in the shit. Quite literally. Fuck it, there's like there's nothing in the Discord that YouTube wouldn't want, right? Unless, Jamie, you've sent me something absolutely unforgivable. Oh! Oh! <laughs> you made a buff slug! Using, I think, the exact same limbs that Pickle Man uses on the buff pickle. That's amazing! <laughs> the Queen has been disposed, executed, Trump in charge of the UK military. What the fuck is this? I truly hate Americans' the amount of posts and the stupidity of it. And there's the cheese stick. That's what I was sent on fucking Snapchat. 
I would watch the Ratatouille meme, but I think that's copyright, and uh, I don't know what Twitch will do to me for that one. Alright, 